census, they counted about 2,900 school-aged children in Center City. By a count that we've done with health department data, over 17,000 children have been born between 2000 and 2008 to Center City families. You can see strollers everywhere when you walk through many of our neighborhoods today. But the quality of public, of public education, excuse me, is often cited as a reason why people move out of the city when their children reach school age. So sort of a two-part question here. One, do you believe that Superintendent Ackerman now is sufficiently focused on this challenge? And either way, are there things you might do as a legislator to help the city retain middle-class families in the public school system? I'll give this first one to Greg. Um. I think we are doing, I, th I think we need to do a lot more, is really what I think. Um, we need to increase our funding for early childhood education. Uh, our Pennsylvania costing out study showed that currently we are spending $3,000 less per pupil here in, here in Philadelphia than we should be. Really, I think we need to re-examine the entire way that we actually go about to fund funding our public education because the fact that there's a direct link between our property taxes and the quality of, the, of public education that our children receives is an archaic process that needs to be changed. We are also the only major American city in the country that doesn't run its own school district. And I think it's pretty clear that our state is not doing a good job of running our school district, so we need to have it brought back to the hands of Philadelphia. And I would hope that our current legislators, especially my opponent, would try to take measures to make that happen. Thank you. I, like you, have noticed when I go door to door that there are many more families with young children and women who are pregnant who are going to stay in the city. And being a person who raised her own family in the city and sent her own children to the public schools here, I am very heartened. And in order to, to help to make these schools better, to provide resources to them, I am very active in bring, bringing grants to a number of schools and participate with them in a variety of activities that help them advertise to other families in Center City. Independence Charter School, I have helped. I have helped Free Area Charter School. I am a big admirer of Greenfield, which is not a charter school, but it has an excellent faculty. And the, the High School of Science and um, Leadership Academy, which is also not a charter school, is a group that I have also helped. I am looking forward to seeing these children in Center City, and I have raised my family here as well. So I think that this is a great positive um, development.